This one's going to get violent, gentlemen. Is there any better way for New Frontier to do what they do best than a four-way Singapore stick fight? I mean, Hayes, even you got to be excited by this. Oh, yeah, I'm just ecstatic to see a bunch of people whack each other with sticks. Yay. Introducing team number one. He's not really selling the product, is he, Kevin? Father-son duo here. They very much impressed in the last four quarters matchup they were a part of here at New Frontier. But this is a whole nother beast with the Singapore stick fight. Of course, everyone has their own sticks. Anything that's considered bamboo, I guess, is legal in this matchup. Well, yeah, but as much as they impressed, sorry to cut you off there, Kevin, real quick antidote. As much as they impressed, they always seem to agree to disagree by everything that they do in the ring together. When SX Jr. gets rolling, See, right, even right now, father is telling his son to focus on the task at hand. He's not letting this kid do what he wants to do, and that may cause some resentment as the match goes longer. Well, for the glory, the father-son team have everything it takes to make it to the very top, and if they could just stay on the same page. Speaking of being on the same page, doesn't get more on the same page than the, hu the husband and wife team of Matt Cash, Jesse Mack, for the hardcore romance. They were Bond victorious last time we saw them. Absolutely, listen, bonded by blood, in love with one another in a sickening sense. I mean, these two are a death match made in heaven. Couldn't put it better myself. This may very well be the team with a sort of advantage when it comes to being on the same page in this match. Arguably the most experienced team we're aware of when it comes to working together. Well, if you're not on the same page as a husband and wife, how could you plan to be the same page of partners in the ring? I mean, let's talk about people who aren't on the same page. Hayes? How do Sorry, I'm, I'm just waiting for the next team to come out so we can get this all started. Personally. This is one of the most exciting wrestlers on the scene today, yesterday, tomorrow, arguably of all time, the Green Phantom, your hardcore hero. Oh, look at that. Essex paid no respect to my hardcore romance and ripping up the sign. What, what in the world is he wearing right now? Uh, I believe he's trying to channel his inner superhero with his hero, the Green Phantom. No, I get, I get what he's, what it looks like a jock strap that he was, that he cut I, in half. I know. I told him the same thing, and he said, "Yeah, I, gr I look great, don't I?" Oh no. Well, no, we, I agree with you. He doesn't look. No, great. I know, but he, did, he said that. Yeah. Well, we well, all know. Why be never to shake his hand? We all worse. know that Kyle is not the most traditional of competitors here, but we are looking at the 2023. Death Proof Tournament winner. And you know, you don't get there oh by boy. mistake, gentlemen. Speaking of Death Proof, though. I'm wrong, uh, gentlemen, but we haven't seen Warhead in, oh, I don't know, like,
like 16 months here in New Frontier? Absolutely right. Ever since the debut show, we have yet to see War Horse, War Head, sorry, back in the ring. Well, he and was he suspended. He used the bamboo sticks. He got his, and the matchmaker made an example out of him. Yeah, but I never understood the suspension. It made no sense. It made no sense. No but sharp objects were allowed in his match. He used them. He got suspended. And he's just been sitting at home. Well, regardless of that, he's here now. And we have yet to figure out who his tag team partner is. He said he would announce it tonight, live here at Immortality. And I guess we're going to hear from Warhead, figure out who he's bringing with him well, the into the Singapore the, stick fight. Well, the mayor, Dick Punch, said he knows a lot of people. It could be anybody at this point. Why did you overemphasize on the word dick? Because he says that a lot. No, I, I, I know who he is and I know what he does, but... You overemphasize that word. I think that you're just feeling uncomfortable by the word, truthfully. No, I'm quite happy with what I have and you're what I work with. with Dick? I don't mind Dick. I mean, it's not my life choice. Oh, look at this! Oh, everyone taking it to Warhead to start things off. Correct me if I'm wrong, though, Hayes. Oh, how about this? We're about to find out. Well, I mean, here he comes his partner right now. It's Aiden Rain! Longtime friend and partner of Warhead, the Prince of Pain and the King of Pain, joining forces. Taking it to Jesse Mack. Here we go. We're off to the races with this four corner Singapore cane match. Oh, look at that. An embrace of, of love before a whole bunch of pain. Oh, and here comes some more pain. Oh, I called that, didn't I? Five seconds, didn't it? The Prince and King of Pain becoming the recipients of pain now. And look at that. And the Green Bastards from Parts Unknown. Uh, he's the Green Phantom, thank you very much. Well, collectively, they are known as the Green Bastards. That is a thing. Adam. I feel like that's a copyrighted thing, but that's besides the point. I feel like they could have done so many different names. The Green Machine, the Greenies. They really could have done a whole lot the of The Greenies? The Greenies. <laughs> like a play on the Blue Meanie, the Greenies. Play on Green I'm Phantom. Go with the Goonies, like, hey, you got the Green Phantom, that's that a Kyle. Great, listen, I will not sully the Green Bastards with the Goonies. The Goonies is a classic. Hayes, okay, you and I might not agree on a lot of things, but I'm sure we agree on that. All right, we agree. Well, it's nice to see some oh! common ground. But that's... Did anybody order a colonoscopy? Why does this always happen in New Frontier? Every single time, there is proctology exams left, right, and center. How about this? Oh! Well, I don't know about that. You know, Green Phantom said in a message to the fans of New Frontier, they're bringing the violence and the sodomy. And they Just started off with that. Match two of a pay-per-view. Well, how about this, guys? The Green Bastards carrying around brown sticks. Get it? <laughs> now Matt Cash, Jesse Mack taking control of this four-way match. Taco Buster right there. Oh, hold and on. And a cannonball oh! from Cash. And I think Kyle might be out cold after that. And did you see the love in Jesse Mack's eyes when she saw Cash do that cannonball? Oh, he's they, been lucky tonight for sure. They have a very unorthodox relationship. It is gross. It's not gross. It's love. It's love in their way. Oh, my hardcore romance. To your wife every time when you give her the present. I'm sorry, don't you want to handcuff Jess is gonna fly! Wow, don't you want to handcuff your wife from the basement when you come home? Because she's got Stockholm Syndrome? Oh, and here comes XS Junior. Oh. XS Senior. The father-son team. Oh no. Tying up Matt Cash in the corner, chopped to the back. Oh, look at that. Using that Singapore cane, and here comes Junior! Oh! Beautiful! Over the leapfrog double stop with a Singapore cane! That's a new one. You know, XS Junior, 17 years old, very young in life, but when it comes to being between those ropes, very well experienced. Oh! oh! Baseball slide right in the face with that stick. Oh, and how about that, Jesse Mack gets an insecurity for her troubles. Remember, it's first ball wins it all. Excess oh. with the double knees to Cash. Smart move by Cash getting the hell out of the ring. Look at this. What the hell is he doing? He's oh. doing a thing of beauty, that's for sure. Those acrobatic skills. Guys, that was poetry in motion. Unbelievable skill level. Can you believe this kid is only 17 years oh. old? But again, XS taking a moment to almost scold his son, and it's coming back 
to bite him in the you know what high and low from the king and prince of pain i guess the the royals of pain if you will i like that the royals of pain that's good that's good well, they are the prince of the king and here comes the prince oh almost a modified version of, of a bisectomy a oh, oh that too much. And Dick one punch. for Kyle. Look how he overemphasizes the word dick. It's because he oh, used he it in his own partner. vocabulary. He had his own partner. He got, he got carried away. He had his own partner. Well, well, I guess much like you, whenever he sees dick, he just gets over the moon about it. Well, not one for XS Jr., but a kick instead. And Jesse Mack. Oh, you can't, you can't do that. Jesse Mack almost laughing it off here. Are you kidding me right now? It's a family friendly event, I think. I don't know if family friendly is the way to go after what we've seen. There's Space nothing, Buster. There's nothing family friendly about Warhead. Does that mean the mayor of Dick Budge City just got dropped out of the race? Bus driver. Speaking of getting dropped, Jesse Space Mack Buster. getting dropped with a headlock driver and cash. Oh, hold on. Oh, that's a, oh my God. Beautiful. Oh, oh here comes Jock. Nice for your action. Well, here comes Jock Strap Sally. <laughs> What are we going to see here? Stretching out XS Jr. Dropping him with some gory bomb. Dropping him face first there, XS Sr. XS isn't like that. Tiger oh, Driver oh, dropping him right on his head and shoulders. Uh-oh, how about this, Green Phantom? On the greenhouse effect applied. Oh. From oh. the hardcore hero. Well, look at that. Warhead and Gravanta know each other very well. Look at that. On oh, Warhead. No. no. I guess we're going to see him in another 16 months, boys. Well, no. Technically, this is bamboo. It's a part of a cane. I guess this counts. Oh, oh my God. Turning Kyle into a, what, what is that, a, a pentacorn? A quintacorn? Uh, I don't know, but it doesn't look fun. Looks like a vegetarian shish kebab. Oh, and again, Warhead almost getting ahead of himself there. Uh-oh, uh-oh, oh Taking oh, no. it to Jesse oh, Mack no. and Cash. Oh. Couple more pentacorns. Warhead getting taken down God for Phantom. by the hardcore hero. Oh. A couple of Singapore cane shots oh, to the Green Phantom. You got For the Glory now, running the ring. They're in there by themselves with that Kyle. For the Glory looking to pick up a big win here. Beautiful double team maneuver from the father son team. I think this is it. Kick out at wow. two. I'm wow. surprised that, that Kyle had something in him to do that. You and me both, oh, Hayes. Jesus. Junior getting shot right to the outside. He is now picking up his own partner. Oh, there we go. I think he's going for the Phantasm. Using Kyle as a weapon. There it is. The Green Bastards victorious in their debut as a team. You can't deny it. I mean, not the most skilled team in terms of being together and having that chemistry. But they did it. They absolutely did it, guys. Well, that they did. Making parts unknown. Proud. That Kyle, the Green Phantom, standing tall in their debut as a team. I know, the least experienced team in this whole damn thing winds up winning the whole thing. That's what I just said. Well, I, I just said, said than, that. I said it better than I hate you. Can somebody mute it? Can somebody? You know what? Stop talking about Terry. Oh, we'll get to Tarek when we get to him as he goes one-on-one -on -one with John Green later tonight. But currently, the Green Phantom, that Kyle, standing tall, sky's the limit for this team of hardcore stars. As we move forward here live tonight in Port Hope, and as we move forward live on the Fight Network, if you're joining us on the Fight Network, welcome. Both Kevin and I are deeply apologetic for the fact that you have to hear Adam Hayes. Good time sitting here next to you, George. Hayes, I know we don't agree on everything. I don't, you know, feel the same way about you as George does. I think you're a somewhat respectable young man when the, the mood calls for it. 